Okay, this is a comparison of the Rode NT USB microphone and the Shure SM57, which is on a shock mount and it's got the Shure pop shield on it, which I don't know what that's called. Okay, this is a comparison of the Rode NT USB microphone and the Shure SM57, which is on a shock mount and it's got the Shure pop shield on it, which I don't know what that's called. And I'm in a really reflective room here. I've got no carpets, no curtains. There's nothing on the walls very much. If you can hear any noise, it's the computer noise that's just underneath both these microphones. They're in both about the same place. And I'm in a really reflective room here. I've got no carpets, no curtains. There's nothing on the walls very much. If you can hear any noise, it's the computer noise that's just underneath both these microphones. They're in both about the same place. So I'm just gonna read out something from Wikipedia just so you can get an idea. So I'm just going to read out something from Wikipedia just so I can get an idea. The MOS Technology 6502 is an 8-bit microprocessor that was designed by a small team led by Chuck Peddle for MOS Technology. The MOS Technology 6502 is an 8-bit microprocessor that was designed by a small team led by Chuck Peddle for MOS Technology. The, team the, the design team had formerly worked at Motorola on the Motorola 6800 project. The, team desired, the, the design team had formerly worked at Motorola on the Motorola 6800 project. I've tried to get them recording at about the same level and the Shure microphone is going through um, a Behringer, Behringer Zenix Q8. It's a Behringer Zenix Q802 mixer. So that's what's doing the, that's what the sound's going through. There. I've tried to get them recording at about the same level and the Shure microphone is going through um, a Behringer, Behringer Zenix Q8. It's a Behringer Zenix Q802 mixer. So that's what's doing the, that's what the sound's going through there. The theory is that the Shure SM57 is a lot less reflective than the condenser microphone, than the Rode condenser microphone, but we shall see. The theory is that the Shure SM57 is a lot less reflective than the condenser microphone, than the Rode condenser microphone, but we shall see.